What's up everybody? After many months of waiting, we finally received the railing for a house remodel that we worked on in the past. So let's go ahead and get it installed. So this railing system that we're working to install today is called a view rail. It's a nice rod railing system and it seemed easy enough to work with. I got this level section where the posts are installed. I have the rods run through. We'll have to cut off the ends of these and finish it up there. But I'm gonna go ahead and install the posts down here. We've officially got all of the posts installed. So the next step in this process is to take this threaded crimp piece, put it into the end of each rod like this. Then I had to take a crimp tool, crimp it down on there. Now that we have the threaded crimps, on one side of the rod. We need to go ahead and cut down the extra length on the other side. That way we can put on the threaded crimp for that side and then tension it. With all of the threaded ends now crimped onto the rod, we can take this finishing piece and it will thread on just like this. It goes on and then we push it through and it gives this nice finishing look right there. Now that we have all these finished ends on the end of the rods, they actually have this Allen head fitting. And so I'm taking this wrench and going ahead and tensioning the rods. There's a specific sequence that I need to do. I start from the middle and then had to start feathering out. So I started right here, and this will be two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, we officially have all of the rods nice and tensioned for this level run. This is taking quite a bit longer than I was really expecting it to. It's a somewhat intricate process, but still it looks absolutely phenomenal. So I'm excited to go ahead and start working on that angle one and wrap this thing up. We've now got the handrail installed onto the railing here and this thing looks amazing. This handrail is just temporary for right now. We have some custom wood that is getting fired in a kiln and then we'll go ahead and make a custom handrail. But in the meantime, this should work out. And so with that, we are all wrapped up here for installing this railing. I have to say this system is pretty easy to install once you get it learned and, uh, and it looks good. So with that, we are all wrapped up here. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more cool videos like this, check out these.